Either way, let's just proceed because we finished the collectibles anyway. The Bone Goliath is the next location. Seems like we only need to collect one power up in here. Cutscene without audio. You love to see it. Seems like there is thunder. Very broken floor. It's just a pile of bones. I wonder where the boss guy is. Oh, is this a boss fight? The evil villain returns and makes the skeleton alive. This can be good, says the voodoo doll. I am guessing it makes some weird noises. Definitely not good, says weird. And we are back. Let me also try googling the audio issue. Maybe I will find a fix on Google. Uh, voodoo wins. Cutscene. Audio. I don't see any... Everything I see is from 2017 and there isn't any... Like, fix that I can see. That's unfortunate. That's unfortunate, but what can be done? You must find the Zap Hat and find a way to bring down the fury of the storm onto yourself. It will work. Really. I don't know what this is. It's the Zap Hat from Kyla's Dino Bosses. Interesting. I don't see... I'm guessing we need to go up. It's like a plane. Okay. We did something. I did not die. I did die. Never mind. It happens. I am not entirely sure what are we supposed to be doing. Probably something with the head, but... Where do we take the head, is the question. Pulling on that lever revealed some uh, thingy somewhere. Let's see, it's this. This is the thing it revealed. This is where we fell down before. Oh my freaking god. That's going to be difficult. Suddenly I am losing lives. And it was going so well.
Well, it is what it is. Also, I just noticed that they are shooting in the painting. I mean, it's the first boss of the game, it shouldn't be too difficult. We just need to figure out what is our goal. I am guessing our goal is to not fall when we get up here. Which is easier said than done. Okay. We opened the window and it's snowing or raining. That's some progress at least. Now what? Another level. Which opened the thing from the beginning. Okay. I'm guessing we need to get back to the beginning. I didn't even see that tail come in. Where is the thing? Oh my god. That's some hefty slapping that the dinosaur does. We got here. And we used the thing and it electrocuted the dinosaur. Sadly without audio, but that happens. I am guessing the noises that the dinosaur made were probably fun. Stay extinct, says Wins. And what's that down there? Seems like a power up that we need to collect. Let's grab it. Killer bees. And another area reached. Once again without audio. Hey, watch the equipment, said the weird lady. Sorry, say, I am looking for a friend of mine. Nice girl, kind of wise looking. Found head to foot. I might be able to help you, given a little incentive. You scratch my shell, I scratch yours. You know what I mean? I hope not. Tell you what. I am working on a highly complex project here, very advanced and scientific. Only a gifted inventor like me can grasp the theories involved. You are building a balloon. Uh, yeah. Looks like you need some cloth for the balloon, a propeller to steal it, and some gas for the barn. Yeah. I am on it, see you later. And while I'm gone, why don't you invest some bread? Something? Bread mints? Probably stinky, stinky bread. Okay. We need 10 blue bottles and 2 purple thingies. Should be easy to do. Seems like a small area. There are some at the top. I did notice them out of the corner of my eye. Oh, there is the one. What was the... point otherwise of coming up here? Probably... Nothing. Let's check what's over here. Bunch of blue bottles, you'll have to see it.
Seems like something down there is as well. But before I got there, we already collected all 10 of the thingies. We still need the purple ones, so let me see if we can find those. Shouldn't be too difficult, I don't think. Maybe over here? That's apparently a dead end, okay. Well, seems to me like the only way forward is to jump down. I don't see anything else anywhere nearby. I also don't see the skeletons anywhere. Which is a bit... Worrisome. There is a path over there and a path over there. Let's go this way first. This is the Roachport main tunnel. Two which... of the items you seek are beyond blocked passageways. There are monsters you can trick into helping you. Okay. Hey Arant, why don't you just turn around and go back? You'll never get past the stuff I cooked up down here. Said the cutscene man. I wish the audio was fixed, but... Unfortunately, there is nothing I can do at the moment. Can we jump that high? I guess we can, but we need to be more... ...careful about it, is my guess. There we go. Okay, collectibles collected. You love to see it. There are also some at the top I just noticed. Not entirely sure how to reach up there. Maybe from some different area. Let's just proceed. And hopefully we can figure something out. Uh, let's see. That's the fast travel which we don't need. This that... must be one of those block tunnels Charmaine was yapping about. There is a lot of blocked doors. Good job, Vince. The wheels are turning. I did a thing. Is this lock? This switch is still out of reach. Find a way to open the grate. Looks like we did things a bit out of order because if I'm not mistaken that switch made these platforms spin. So this could have been easier than we had it. I guess this is how we get up there. Mistakes been made. I survive. Okay. Another switch. Ah, we're almost there. We do be almost there. It's true. We just need to do some back and forth, back and forth. Ah, uh, where was the... There it is. Okay. Very nice! 
a hidden place can now be explored. I guess the audio only breaks when the camera is like cinematic or something. Which is a bit weird, but it is what it is. We almost have everything. The monsters are free. Be careful! If you stand too close, they will try to roll into you. And there should be two more blue things somewhere. Okay. Door has been opened. This goes somewhere completely different. Spinning high above this cavern is a perfect propeller for the doctor's balloon. Reaching it will be difficult. Removing it from the ceiling will pose a challenge as well. Let's see. Time for a challenge. This doesn't seem too difficult, it's just waiting. Thanks so much for playing. He thanked us for playing. Dropelex switch. We cannot use it yet. Not yet, but soon. That enemy is kind of stressing me out. Because I don't know where to go. Um, it seems like a dead end, to be honest. Let's try going back. Seems to me like there is a second path over here that we can take. It seems to me like this was probably the first thing that we were supposed to do. There is a lot of stuff that we can collect apparently. See any more of collectibles in there? A eight and spin to travel farther. I see. And this is a much bigger area than I originally thought. This nice. We need to remember to go back to the previous room because there were some collectibles that we didn't pick up try to keep me alive this time seems like it's time for Frogger. how am i supposed to Like that, I take it? No! I think I... Did an oopsie, we only have three more lives. Turns out this game is more difficult than I expected it to be.
This trash can seems to be useful. I forgot that the uh, boxes go underwater periodically. Not good. This is where I die, obviously. Not this time, though. Oh, that's nice. Let's check what's in this room. Seems like this game will get more and more difficult. Which is to be expected. It is what it is. Hopefully if we get a game over stream we won't lose too much progress. Don't know how it works in this game. And ever... Ever since that uh, Crash Bandicoot 1 loss of progress, I am always worried that it will happen again. Okay. Which is understandable, I think. So let's see. This brings us up here for the elevator. Okay. And this stops the blades from spinning. Okay. Or slows them down. Not too sure. There is still stuff down there that we need to collect. For now we are getting the bottles and such. What does this button do? It slows it down even more. I guess our job is to maybe slow it down completely or something. That was a risky jump. But it did pay out in the end. Another power up. You love to see it. I certainly do. This should stop it, maybe. Ah, not... Not quite. Almost, though, almost. There is, I guess, one more level. Maybe over here. Ah, seems like it. And it's stopped. Okay. Before I go down... 23 out of 25. I still miss two blue things somewhere. And I think I know where. So before I go down, let me go 
back to the room that we came from. Which was over here. Let me... Jump. I think this way... Because, yeah, there are the last two bottles that we need. And there is also a bunch of extra lives over there. Which I kind of need since I died a bunch of times. This might be a stupid thing to do, but... Let's risk. Actually, there are only two extra lives. That's still pretty good, though. And we survived, so I don't feel too bad about going back there. And now we just need to reach back where we've been before. And go pull the lever that has been revealed. This level will be therefore complete as we collected everything. Which is lovely. I keep taking damage from this enemy mines. Okay. Elevator can probably take us there. Okay. Let's be careful. This should be the thing that we need to get. Of course, somehow it shrinked while it fell down. And it kicked us out of the area. Good work, hon. How about finding some fuel? Okay. So that's nice. We still miss two skeletons somewhere in here. I have no idea where. And it's kind of bugging me. I guess it wants us now to go into the door on the right. But we will go back into the door on the left. Because I'm pretty sure we didn't collect everything. I am pretty sure, yeah, we are missing two blue bottles somewhere in here. And if I had to guess, it will be that door at the end of the room. Thanks so much for playing. Well, that's just leads somewhere completely else. Not too sure where the last two bottles in that area are. And before I go into this room properly, let me backtrack and Hey you found my old lab. I'd forgotten all about this place. Look over there, there is a canister of the fuel we need for the balloon. It's real heavy, but you can fly it out of here in the FX21 mini plane. I built it myself. Nice. Try not to scratch it while you are carrying that canister of highly flammable rocket fuel. Past the raging something. We'll see you back there. Let me go back. 
I wanna figure out where the last two blue things are located. Obviously not in here. Not over there either. Did I miss something up here? No. And we cannot really go anywhere from up there. There is a doorway over here, but I die. Good thing I'm washing wear. Well, well, well. We found what we were missing. You love to see it. Hurts to be you. And now we can go through that door at the end. Seems like this will be a difficult area to traverse. Since that is the plane. Let me also, we can scroll through all the levels we've been into. So, everything, 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 everything. We are missing two skeletons from the scientist. This is where we are at the moment. And everything, everything, everything. I'm guessing we will get the missing skeletons after we finish searching for the required items. That's my guess, but I've been wrong before. I guess that's just elevators, nothing crazy going on, I think. Okay. So far so good. I don't know if I can jump that high, but I must be able to because there is no other way of going here. Nice. Seven more potions somewhere. Maybe at the top somewhere. I caught fire. I don't see anything down here. Let me... Double check. I know that we need to go through... Yeah, there are two over there. There must be a way upstairs somewhere. This is where we came from. We need to get somehow over there. Oh. I didn't even see the elevator. That explains everything. Okay, so we need to drop down there for the two bottles. 
I will do that last. First let me climb all the way up and collect whatever is up there. It's the plane. I'm pretty sure you cannot use it yet. Yeah. I'm not sure what why I cannot jump on that. Weird. We need five bottles. I know where I know where to are. I don't know where the remaining three are. There are the two. I have no idea. There are the two. I guess the tree must be hidden really well. Okay. What's the quickest way of getting for those? I guess just drop and hope for the best. Let me try going It's not what I meant to do uh, We are missing three bottles somewhere, I'm not sure where Hmm They could be just hidden really well. Behind something. Maybe. Good thing I'm washing wear. There is Pamnast at the top. Which allows us to look around. There is a Okay. No, that's where we came from. That's where we came from. Okay. No matter where I look, I don't see the missing bottles anywhere there is what seems to be a gate but I don't know what how to open it let's try to bring this to the plane hopefully that will help us figure out what must be done. Where do I... What happened? Can we not fall while we hold the bottle or something? If so, that's kind of... kind of rough. Let's see. I guess we can only travel through elevators due to the flammability of the of the thing. 
Pressurized gas isn't fireproof. Who knew? I thought I was out of reach, to be honest. Well, time for the third attempt. Eventually, we will succeed, I am certain. Have we tried going this way? Let's see. I think we need to go this way. It's kind of like a puzzle. We can sneak behind those. Just to be safe, I will wait. Now this allows us to go this way, but that way is closed, so we need to go this way. Makes sense. It's really like a puzzle. I am guessing this will bring us back up. Indeed, it does. We need to figure out how to break that door over there. I think that's where the last collectibles are located maybe if I jump Sheesh, these things don't like touching the ground okay. there we go collectibles found Extra life found. And basically we unlocked a shortcut it seems like. Which is also very very lovely. This will be probably the difficult part. Are we fast enough? That was close. Oh my god, somehow we did it. Very, very, very stressful obstacle to deal with. Let's wait. Let's go. Okay. Another one of these, let's see. Did it? And did it? He's heavily, heavily stressing me out, to be honest. Please, please, please. I'm so close to victory. Yeah, we do have everything. Nice. Throttle up. Steer plane. And boost. Okay. Are there any collectibles in this? Doesn't seem like it. So, at least that's good. 
We just need to avoid obstacles, I think. We failed. Good Let's try again. Extra life is appreciated. That's for sure. That was close. Okay. This is kind of fun. I like it. Easy to control. Once again, that was close. is difficult but fair I wonder how long this level is seems kind of long Seems like there is a checkpoint, so that's nice. But yeah, this is quite long. I think that's the exit. I think we did it. This ought to do the trick. Now find me some cloth. Locked. Okay. I still don't know how to get the two skeletons from this area. Let me check upstairs once more. I don't see anything suspicious, so I'm not sure. I'm sure we will eventually figure it out. For now, it's a mystery. I mean, if we look from over there, from over here, I mean, I don't see any collectibles along the walls. I mean, that area is a bit sus. Let me go check it out. But yeah, I don't see any skeletons. Actually, we cannot go back up there. I still see the spikes in the middle of the room. I guess now we need to go to the right side. I am pretty sure we collected everything on the left side. Yeah, let's go. The upper city. Seems like another parkour heavy section with a lot of collectibles. Might be a difficult area to fully fully explore. But we will try our best, that's for sure. I apparently do not have enough movie power. Which is understandable. 
I am not killing enough enemies. Doesn't seem like there are any hidden spots. Now this is nice. Acid bar. I accidentally used it. Says hi. That was a really sad mistake on my part. But it happens, you know. It happens to the best of us. Clumsiness is only natural. I see you. Lots of lots of cards over here. Did I collect them all on my first try? It seems like I did. You'd love to see. How was I supposed to see that from him? I guess this is how we get the cards in the middle of the room. Maybe not. Oh, this. I guess this works. Now let me go back down because I'm pretty sure there is stuff that needs to be collected. One sneaky potion behind the ship. And one stinky bug. The bugs are kind of ruthless. As one would expect, I guess. What's this? Just a candle, not nothing. Nothing special. What's the point of this platform? That's the doorway. Okay. I'm trying to stomp the enemies, but... Those flying ones are really difficult to hit for some reason. I don't know if we got everything we needed to get, but I see one more bottle over there. Which seems it will be easier to get from the top. There we go. I doubt we can get back up there from here. So... How are we? 23 more cards and 4 more bottles. I don't see any bottles in here. I don't think. So, I guess they must be at the up somewhere. By which I mean at the top. English is slipping away, slowly. 
that out of some over there. Thanks so much for playing. No problem. Are we supposed to jump this? I will take a educated guess and say yes. I'm not sure. Okay, we found all the blue potions. And this will give us all the cards, I think. Unless we missed like one at the top of the jump. Seems like we got them all. Where will this lead us? It's going to be a long, long... Long, long trip. My guess is it leads back to the top of the level. Which might be... Easy or hard, depending on which route it takes. It goes this way, okay. Oh, that's it, okay. Nice. That's another thing collected. It says one out of one. Nice, nice, nice. Now we can just go up and proceed to the next door that I've seen. But yeah, I am enjoying this game. I think this is a very very lovely experience. The only issue I really see is the buggy audio in the cutscenes, but other than that it's a very very nice game. I presume that the original version from the original release probably didn't have the audio issues. That might just be the issue of the remastered version. Here is the cloth for Dr. Ethel's balloon, just hanging there for the taking. But to gather it, you must take a very unusual land. But it is what it is, it happens. How do I switch lanes? Oh, like that. Okay, I want to try again if I can. Keep to the places where the lines are clear. Change tracks to avoid posts and obstacles. And I want to try to collect everything. If I can. So far so good. I'm not exactly sure why are we collecting shirts that have room for four hands. But you know, it is what it is. God damn, I missed some. Let me try again. I 
want to actually try my best to get the collection going. I don't know if there are like checkpoints when you die, but... We will see. Beginning isn't too difficult anyways. I just got bamboozled. This time I didn't get bamboozled. Which is lovely. I don't know if there is a checkpoint or not. That was close. Whoops. Now where does it restart me? I'm still here. All the way back. That's horrible actually. This might take way longer than I thought. But eventually we will succeed. I missed one. You know what? That's okay. I don't think we get anything special for collecting all of them. Otherwise it would be written in the post screen right there. I need to remember to dodge the obstacle that previously killed me. I don't remember where the obstacle was located. It was... oh my god. Was it literally the same obstacle that just killed me? I think I got a game over, kind of. It restarted me with three lives. We didn't lose any progress, seemingly. That's okay. We are learning. Despite dying multiple times, I actually like this mini game. It's quite kind of kind of fun. I just wish there was like a Checkpoint or something in the middle. But that would be too easy, I guess. So maybe it's better this way. Let's see. I think so far we have everything. I think I missed some in there. Uh, I'm definitely missing some. It's getting harder to pick them up. I missed like 5 or something. And you cannot even see properly. Well... How was I supposed to avoid it? Actually we reached 0. So we didn't need to collect all of them after all. Excellent. Now stand back. 
Okay, short stuff. Let's blow this no something. We still missed the two skeletons of this area, which is a bit worrying. Okay, I was thrown off the board, or rather thrown overboard. Well, another boss fight, it seems like. Aren't always better than one. Find a way onto the back of this beast. Diving from high above, you can amplify your power. Can I? Oh, this is what the platforms are for. Let's see. He went the other way when I got here. So what do we need to do? Do we not ju just need to jump on the creature's back? Which then makes us jump out the way up. Which enables spikes. Okay, I'm confused. I am once again confused about what must be done. I am guessing we need to pull the lever and jump into the spikes because we are a voodoo doll and that will kill the boss or something. Did it work? I think it did, and if I had to guess, we need to do it three times because this is a game, and games always seem to be about that count of three and such. Nice. I smell tacos. We got kicked off the platform. Did it restart the health of the boss, I wonder? I hope not. Oh my god, I freaking missed. That's unfortunate. I am having some bad luck with this boss. I think I am too slow and I cannot... Let's just go this way. It does so much damage. I hope the progress didn't restart when we failed to stay alive. Let's see. This is the second. Unless it restarted. Where is he going? Over there. Okay, therefore I go over here. Good thing I'm washing wear. I'm starting to get a little bit tilted from this boss, I must say. Yeah, 
it seems to be a bit rough to deal with. Okay, this should be the third time. And it worked, I think. Seems like it at least. They rolled down the cliff. And we... Found the gas. That is the freaking skeleton we needed. But there is still one more somewhere. That we missed. I'm not entirely sure where. Before I use the freaking thing. Can we even get back to the... First room? I don't know. Let's try using this. Let's see what it does. It blows our head. Okay. And that takes us to a new location. So the skeleton we missed has to be obtained in some other way. 